Our project was a pair of functional 3D printed headphones. We designed and 3D printed them. And the whole purpose of our device was to allow patients the option to do their cardiac rehab from home. Cardiac rehab is a medically supervised program between the physician or the cardiac rehab therapist and the patient. It involves exercise and education, and the whole point of it is to improve the patient's lifestyle. And um, really, it's for patients who have cardiovascular disease. So cardiovascular disease is the number one cause of death in the U.S. right now. Approximately 84 million people have cardiovascular disease, and the people that complete their cardiac rehab, it reduces their chance of mortality by 30%. However, currently there's only a 20% participation in the program because you have to go to an outpatient clinic to do it. So our pair of headphones, it fully functions as a head, pair of headphones. You can listen to music on them, you can take calls, but it also takes your O2 saturation, your pulse, your ECG, and we're actually able to allow them to calculate your blood pressure without a cuff. So that's really what was really innovative about it. So all these signals, so all these signals are taken and we actually created both a patient application and a doctor application. So there's a Bluetooth module in the pair of headphones and all the signals are live streamed to a patient application. Um, so the patients can kind of keep up with their progression through cardiac rehab and make it more personal. And the, there's a doctor application as well that we created and we used a Firebase database. So all these signals are sent via Bluetooth to the patient app, but they're actually sent to this database. That, and then the app, the doctor's application, pulls these signals from that database. So not only are you able to see your signals in live time, but the doctor is able to see your signals in live time from anywhere around the world. Cardiac rehab is education and exercise, and so the education is built into the patient application. There's a pot spot where the doctor can, you know, update the fact of the day, click create a link, so this kind of takes care of the education part of it. But the exercise part of it is really what our device is used for, to monitor those signals during exercise. And so we thought that if the patients can listen to music while they do it at the same time, you know, maybe they already wear headphones, then they don't have to add another device to it. So they're wearing the headphones, but all these signals are kind of taken in as well. So all you have to do is put on your pair of headphones and from, there's a, it's called a PPG sensor and so that takes your O2 saturation and your pulse and there's an ECG module located inside of the headphones. So that's kind of how we had to customize them. We had to custom design them because all the modules fit inside of the pair of headphones. Um, and so all the user has to do is put on the pair of headphones and then he has to put on the three electrodes and so then he can still listen to music. And then another good thing is that with the headphones is if the doctor's looking at your signals and your ECG is, you know, he sees your ECG looks funny or it's flatlining. Um, you know, that's a big safety risk, so he can call you right away, because you can do it. We have VoIP built into our, our headphones, so he can call you, and you can take the call through your headphones, and you can be like, okay, you need to sit down until your blood pressure gets back low, or your ECG settles down a bit, so it puts that safety feature in there as well. So we really were able to take all of the needs of the patient and really put it into one all-inclusive device.